In just a few hours, when Portland residents head to the poll, they'll be deciding on the size of future Portland homeless shelters. Tonight, the Portland City Council moved forward with its plan for a homeless services center. New Center Main Sean Stackhouse has the latest. Portland City Council finalizing its plan for a 200 bed homeless services center in the Riverton neighborhood. Hey, that passes unanimously 8-0. Uh, thank you, everybody. The City Council voting to sign a lease with the developers chosen for the project, DC Riverside LLC. For now, pushing forward the $25 million project. This work has been years in the making. Um, the City Council, through varying membership and city staff, have worked to find a way to move the city's emergency shelter out of rented space on Oxford Street to a permanent home on city-owned property. Monday's vote coming just one day before Portland voters see a referendum question on the size of future homeless shelters. Many, during public comment, urging the City Council to postpone its decision. I think to some extent, trying to vote on this tonight preempts the voice of the, of the voter tomorrow. I implore you, do what is right and postpone this vote until the people have had their say at the polls. But the city's corporation council says the referendum doesn't apply to the Homeless Services Center since it's already been approved. But those supporting option A in the referendum, which calls for smaller shelters with a 50 bed capacity, says it does apply. Counselors expect litigation if option A passes and may revisit the topic. I would imagine in the event that there was overwhelming um, support for option A tomorrow, um, we may want to come back as a council and, um, and talk about tonight's decision. But for now, City Council has agreed to sign the lease agreement on the 200-bed shelter with wraparound services to support those experiencing homelessness. In Portland, Sean Stackhouse, New Center, Maine. And at its meeting tonight, Portland City Council also voted to approve a plan to allocate more than $14 million in federal funding from the American Rescue Plan Act. Three and a half million dollars would go toward the Homeless Services Center. Other funds will go toward repair of the Kiwanis Community Pool, as well as funding for parks and recreation, public health, and affordable housing.